our bear down on the floor. And we're gonna use our marching feet around our bear. We're marching in a circle. Marching, marching, marching. March, march, march. And one, two, three, stick. And stop your bodies. Very nice. We're gonna run around our bear. Use those running feet. Running, running, running. Running, running, running. And one, two, three, stick. Now we're gonna see if we can jump all the way over our stuffed animal to a stick. Ready? One, two, three, big jump. Stick. Good. We're gonna see if we can jump backwards now. Make sure that you have some safe space behind you. We're gonna jump all the way over our stuffed animal. One, two, three, jump in. Stick. Let's try that again. Ready? We're jumping forward. One, two, three, jump in. Stick. Very good. We're gonna try that backwards again. Ready? One, two, three, jump in. Stick. Very nice. We're gonna take our stuffed animal. And he's gonna go for a walk all the way down our leg. Walk and walk and walk and all the way down to tickle your toes. Wah! And run all the way home. We're gonna try the other side. Ready? Taking our stuffed animal for a walk all the way down to the other side. And tickle your toes. Wah! Run him back home. Whew. Okay, this time we wanna see how far our stuffed animal can walk all the way away from us. Uh oh, he walked so far away he got a little sleepy and took a nap. Let's wake him up. Wake up. And bring your bear back home. All right. We're going to put our stuffed animal between our feet. We're going to squeeze really, really tight. We're going to do a little bit bigger donkey kicks. We're going to have strong, straight arms. And we're going to see how high we can lift our stuffed animal up. Are you guys ready? One, two, three. Let's lift our stuffed animal up. Whew. Remember to squeeze them really tight. Squeeze them those legs together so it doesn't go flying away. Let's try that again. Ready? And now we're ready to start with our shape jumps. So first, she's just going to do her straight jumps with a nice straight body stretching up to the sky. She's going to do five of those. Go for it. One. Stretch it up as high as you can, working on that nice stick every single time. Nice straight line from your fingers to your feet. Next up, we're going to do our tuck jumps. So make sure you're getting your knees all the way up to your belly and not just tucking your feet to your bottom. We're going to get our knees up really high. See if you can get them all the way up to your chin. Three, do jump half turns. So on these ones, you're gonna start facing one direction, jump and land and face the other direction. One, good. Two, and he's gonna try that one more time. Everybody at home, come join us. Tuck your chin, forward roll, and stand all the way up. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, Another lunge, good. And a, oh, look at that letter T. You can almost, everybody put your hands down on the floor. Walk those toes all the way up. And we're gonna count to 10 this time. Just remember if you get a little too tired, you can always climb back down. Here we go. One, two, three. Now she's gonna go like she's going into that cartwheel rock, but then she's gonna jump and land on her other foot first. Good, it's that one one more time. So we're gonna go forward. Run, 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 ninja stance. Whoa. Whoa, very nice. And then we're gonna go backwards and ninja stance. Whenever you get past all of your shapes. All right, so next we are going to glue our feet together and we're going to do jumping feet next to our objects. Ready, set, go. We're jumping, jump, 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 all the way forward to your best ninja stance. Very nice. All right, next we are going to do some running feet in between our, diff our different objects. So we're gonna be zigzagging through them all the way to our best ninja stance. And then we're gonna try to do that back on the way back. You guys ready? Set, go for it. Oh, try not to knock down any of your animals or your cones and whoo, nice work. And now this one, be careful, we're back. All right, for our next one, we will be gluing our feet together and we're gonna try to jump over our objects. All right, you're gonna jump all the way over to the other side and do your best ninja stance. Ready, set, go for it. Jumping over. And whoo, ninja stance, very nice. Their other hand, so, or your stuffed animal, yep all the way under your leg to your other hand. Whoa, can you switch legs? And switch. Are you guys ready? We're gonna do one big chop. One, two, three, throw it and hi -ya! So she's gonna start by putting her hands down on the floor. Her feet are gonna stay glued. She's gonna walk those hands all the way out to her plank shape and hold and walk her hands all the way back. That's one, she's gonna do that five times. Go for it, Molly. Now, from this plank shape, remember you can always drop down to your knees or go to your elbows if you need to, but she's gonna move on to her shoulder tap. She's gonna tap each shoulder five times. Two, two, three, 
Everybody go down and push back up. That's one. We're going to try this five times. And two. And three. And four. everybody up. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Four feet back behind her. Now she's going to try to walk her feet to one direction. All the way to the side until she has to pick up a hand to go to her side plank. Then put that hand behind her and go to her reverse plank and keep going. See if you can make it in a full circle without having to sit down on the ground at all. Good. If you can make it around one direction, try to go back the other way. So going around the world the other way. Making sure you keep those hips above the floor as much as you can. Good. Nice work. Keep going, everyone. All right. And that's our planks for today. Thanks for joining us.